Let's get something straight as for the burden of proof. The earth appears to be flat. No one can argue with that because when, for example, when I posted the video when I was at the CN Towers, the CN Tower, pardon me, the, the Globers were saying, uh, you're not high enough to see the curve. You're never high enough. Eh? In a plane, you're not high enough, even if some globers say, I've seen the curvature from a plane. But then Felix Baumgartner is a Red Bull John. The, the globers have been deceived by the fisheye lens. You can see the curvature of the earth, but uh, in, um, in his door, you can see the, the horizon is flat and uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson confirms that you're not high enough to see the curve at the height which Felix Baumgartner was. So it appears to be flat. And as for moving, does it appear to move? No. It appears that the stars are moving and we've been said that no, 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 it's not the stars that move, it's the earth that rotate and it appears that the star rotate because of the earth that spin, but you can't feel the earth. It appears that the stars are spinning, uh, well, spinning, rotating, slowly rotating and the same for the moon and the sun. You see the sun and the moon cross the sky, but no, 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 it's not the moon and the, the, the sun that crosses the sky. It's the, it's the earth that moves, that, that rotates around, the, the moon rotates around the, the, the earth and the, the earth rotates around the, the sun, okay? But that, that's not what we observe. So... That's when the burden of proof is on the one making the extraordinary claim, which is the earth is a ball and it moves, moves and moves and moves. It moves in all kinds of different ways, which we can't observe. Okay, so if you claim that the earth is a ball and it moves, the burden of proof is on you. Because it hasn't been proven, it has been said and said and said and said. But when you say the earth is a ball or a globe, if you prefer, that rotates and then revolves around the sun and the sun revolves around the, the great attractor and all this shoots from the Big Bang, it's because you repeat what you've been said. You haven't observed that, obviously. You haven't calculated that. You haven't looked into it at all. At all. Okay? So that is not what we observe. So it doesn't matter if we, we've all learned that the Earth is a ball and it rotates and uh, all the heliocentric mod model. If it's not true. It's not true. It's not proven. You haven't proved it. No one have proved that the Earth is a ball. No one has proved the curvature. Hey, uh, in the first, uh, the, the first conversation I had with Craig McNeil, he told me, I measure rotation. And after that, I noticed that he says that a lot. But ask him for his, da the, his data. Do, do, do we have proof that you measure curvature? He's never going to show you anything. He, say, he, he told me, I don't have to prove it to you. That's not how science, science works. So it's easy to say, oh, yeah, I have proven curvature. Yeah, okay, show it to me. Oh, I don't have to show it to you. That's not how science works. Okay. That's very scientific. So we see the earth flat. We all see it flat. You're not high enough to see the curvature. Okay, that means you see it flat. So the burden of proof is on you. If you don't see a curvature and you can calculate with lasers and uh, we can see too far with the Nikon uh, P900, P1000. So we see that it's flat. You claim that it's a ball and it moves, prove it. 
The burden of proof is on you. And I'm not repeating what I've been said. That's the way it is. That's what the burden of proof is. You see something, but if some, someone else comes and says, you yeah, know, it appears to be like that, but it's not. It's not. It's, it's because of something else. So I'm going to say to this person, yeah, can you prove it? Because to me, it's pretty obvious that what I see is what I get. So if the person doesn't prove it, he is irrelevant. So the globe is irrelevant. It's been said and said and said and said and said and said, never proven. The burden of proof is on the globe.